So today we're going to be talking about uh, normals and how you can fix them inside of Unreal Engine. So uh, just to demonstrate this, we're first going to be bringing out something that works as an example for us so we can follow along and see what the issue is. So let's see, let's say I have this big sphere here. So this sphere is actually supposed to be some kind of a dome and I want this dome to be a uh, sort of, I don't know, a starry sky or maybe something that someone can see from the inside of the dome out. Now, in this case, I might just want to apply a material to this and we can see that I have a starry sky. The problem is I can't see the starry sky on the inside because the surface on this sphere is on the outside. This can happen through a multitude of reasons, but usually it's uh, something like uh, when you're making a model in Blender, you're putting a, a surface in the wrong direction, meaning that normal is in a different direction than you want it to. So the quickest way to fix this if you're modeling with something is probably just to go back into Blender, Blender and fix it in there. Uh, but you don't need to do that in case you're working inside of Unreal Engine for many cases. And I'll show you why here. So in this case here, we want to see this material on the inside. So the easiest go to reason or solution would be something like going in here and saying, I want to have a two sided material. And then you go back here and then you can see, okay, we're inside of this uh, dome now and we can see the star sky outside. This is uh, of course the wrong way to do this. And the reason for this is that as you can see, we are seeing the starry sky on the outside and on the inside. We just want to see it on the inside. Doing this means that we are actually doing twice the amount of work instead of just the one we want to have. And that is why that is a bad approach. Now, if we go back to our material and we undo the two sided materials, what we can do is instead we go to this specific mesh that uh, we have created. Let's, let's actually open it up first. So here we have the mesh. And inside of here, we can actually see where the normals are going. So if we go to show and we click in normals, we can see that we have all of these uh, green uh, lines going from the mesh. And we can see that they're like a hedgehog. It's, it's all going outwards. That means that the surface is on, uh, pointing outwards. Uh, if we are instead going to go into our modeling mode, we have our mesh selected. We go to attributes, we go to normals. You can see here we have a few options. Um, if we had a mesh here or a model where there were an inconsistency among the, the, the faces so that some of them were pointing inwards and some of them were pointing outwards, you can click this flag here and hopefully the engine will do its best to try and understand which ones are the ones are supposed to be looking outwards and try to fix it that way. In this case, we have a model or a mesh where all of the normals are pointing in the right direction or in the wrong, all of them are pointing in the wrong direction depending on how we want to see that. It's consistent and cohesive. If we just click in invert the normals and we click accept now, we have inverted the normals. Then you might say, okay, this looks really weird. And the reason for that is if we go inside of this, actually let's go to selection mode again. You can see here inside of our dome, everything looks fine. We actually have our uh, sphere or dome working. From the outside, we can see the, the furthest part, the back part of the sphere still uh, from this angle because we don't actually have the frontal part of the sphere interfering with us because there's not actually any material being rendered on it. So that's why we're actually sort of looking into this. So that's how that works. If we were to open up this uh, uh, mesh again now in our mesh editor, we can go and show our normals and we can see that they're now all instead pointing inwards instead of pointing outwards like they did before. So that's essentially how you do a fix of inverting normals inside of Unreal Engine. You really don't need to do anything more than this. I hope that this was useful. Keep on learning. Take care. A big thank you to all of you who like, comment, subscribe and share my videos or through other means support this channel. You are what makes this channel grow and become a resource for other people to learn from.